The world around us is complex. And so that means from a sustainability perspective, we need to tackle challenges in a holistic way. We need to think about solutions, like how advanced materials are going to enable our net zero transition, and how those materials need to be thought of in a circular economy where we're recovering value from all of those material flows. One of the mechanisms we use to deliver on this sustainability goal is through our Sustainable Materials Innovation Hub. At the Sustainable Materials Innovation Hub, we can go and essentially help small, medium enterprise businesses with a footprint in Greater Manchester to make more sustainable materials choices. We do this through three mechanisms. We do advice, assess and innovate. And by working with those companies, we can help them look towards a more circular way of working with their materials. In our lab, we have several extruders and extrusions how mechanical recycling happens. We also have an industrial composter which can be used to break down compostable plastics. Having that overall picture will help us to reduce plastic wastage and hopefully move towards a more circular way of using plastics rather than the linear way of using plastics that we're at now. So beyond plastics, we have to recognize that we need that same material security across all of those different range of materials that we see in our daily lives. Here at the Royce Institute at the University of Sheffield, we host a range of equipment to help our transition to net zero and more sustainable living. This includes equipment for advanced metals processing to help our manufacturing goals towards net zero. It also includes nuclear waste immobilization on how we can completely mobilize and eliminate waste from nuclear energy, how we can create batteries for a more sustainable future, as well as biomaterials and how we can create materials for a more healthy lifestyle. I work together with the Royce Institute, academia and industry to create routes towards a circular economy for metallic systems. That means that we take into consideration new materials and the way that we produce them from the get-go so that raw elements can be critically eliminated. We take into consideration the recyclability and how we can create materials in a more sustainable way uh, from the get-go. In addition to creating new materials and discovering new material platforms, we're also pioneering manufacturing technologies to help us eliminate waste and recycle raw materials and existing metals. Our work here at the University of Sheffield, in collaboration with the Royce Institute, is paving the way towards sustainable, circular technologies beyond net zero. We have to recognize that the circular economy and net zero transitions actually present a massive economic opportunity for UK businesses. And this is especially true when we look at advanced materials, where if we recover value from these materials at end of life, we can actually provide more economic security to really create value within the UK economy.